some ASMR videos over the weekend and thankfully I ran into one of Jeebie's videos and she talked about how she was gone even though you wouldn't have noticed and she was honest about being a little rusty and I really appreciated that because just, uh, just didn't know how to come back. But I guess being honest is the best way to come back. So I'm just gonna be honest and say that I too will be crusty and rusty with this video because it's been a while. <laughs> a lot has happened. Oh, really good. Things. Just to summarize, I got married. Yes, I got married. It was amazing. It was wonderful. <laughs> and the second thing is as well. Time is like the most precious thing ever and I just want to make sure not to waste a single moment of it and it's been amazing so far. So basically the last month I personally have been in a wormhole of selling my things and giving things away. That was a priority for me because I didn't want to carry things to a new place. I just wanted to feel lighter. And <laughs> that's 
what we did. <laughs> we sold, gave away, and curated everything at this new place. You can tell by my favorite plants there. There's my pothos and my aloe. treat this video kind of like a little tour and now we are in the bathroom Bruce is closed. floor there rolling around and getting some vitamin D which I realized I need maybe I should roll myself to the fridge and turn it off <sighs> it's awesome here I just love light. So right now we're just uh, in the living room. I really don't want to get a coffee table because it takes up lots of room. But I wanted to show you this beautiful coral. This is a video.
kind of want to bleach it to give it like a whiter color charge and it's been so busy I've been trying to change my name and working a little bit and saying goodbye to work and moving and everything was just emotionally exhausting <laughs> really emotionally exhausting and now I'm in this new place and to make some friends and reach out and do my best to make this place our home. It's been good though. I've been uh, taking myself out to the gym. There's like a gym up to 10 minutes away in like five different directions from here. So I've been taking yoga classes and and it's been amazing. You know I need to exercise, so I'm really thankful for that. And over here we have my gaming computer. My gaming computer. And maybe streaming computer. Although I do want to stream on my laptop because I hear it's pretty good quality. I haven't tried. So, would you guys like me to stream? I mean, stream for you guys um, this week? Maybe tomorrow? We'll see. <laughs> and I've got a lot of plants here. I have a fig there, snake plant, some other plants. for me so <laughs> and this is my dining area right here you're on my dining table right now but behind me I have some beautiful decorations this was from my manager at my old job and she gave me a surprise flower weeks ago, so luckily it's still, it's still
and then he proposed and it was just really cute I don't want to divulge the details but that's where this is from cute little slot, I love it I'm probably gonna hang it over there to cover the, uh, to cover this much better, right? Last year's housewarming, and look, I made it bloom again. It makes me so proud to know that it bloomed for me again. So, I hope next year it'll bloom again. We'll see. Easier and better. And this guy, Jamie Oliver, wrote this book called One. And it basically means like one pan, you know, one pan dishes. Minimal, not a lot of mess, not a lot of materials or equipment. And I love how it looks like a blue apron tutorial. It's got all the ingredients here. gonna lie, my cooking has not been the best because I feel like a lot of my creativity is spent making videos and working and plants and so cooking kind of took a back burner. <laughs> Simplifying things will help me make more videos for you guys and have more time for you guys. This place will never be 100% quiet. There's people and planes and trains and birds, and I need to be okay with that. And I hope you can be okay with that too. Because that's just, that's part of life. I always get ASMR in the most busiest places. You know, like a hairdresser or something, or like in a train, even. Just, I never really get it when it's super quiet. And I'll be honest again, one of the reasons I kind of stopped wanting to film at my other place was because of the noises of the birds, which is really sad me because if it wasn't for ASMR videos, I love those bird sounds. I love any sounds. I don't mind it. I love the sound of life. And it's a shame that I let those sounds be a cause of distress for me. Which is why I said, I'm not going to stress about these sounds. I'm going to enjoy it. Even if that means not making videos for the month. So yeah. But here I am. I missed you guys. Thank you for staying with me and <laughs> excited for a more relaxing and fun and sweet videos to come in the future. <laughs> okay. my stream coming up very soon. I'll give it a try. I hope it will be good. And see you guys very soon. And for my Patreon supporters, I will be updating the Patreon for you very soon. Thank you for your support. Thank you guys for being
being here. Love you. Let me know in the comments what you'd like to see, okay? <laughs>